TheGuitarBizarre.com Hi everybody, my name is Louis Miranda here for TheGuitarBizarre.com and once again here to tell you about the chord of the day. And the chord of the day, if you play guitar for a little, or you've been playing for a little while, I'm sure you'll know this chord, the C major chord. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how you can add a little, make it a little bit more dimensional, uh, finding textures, which is something I love to do. I love movable chords, and uh, the last time we spoke, the last time we met, we talked a little bit about that. So I'm going to do the same thing with the C major chord. It's very movable, and you can get some different textures with it. And for example, I'm going to move it. Here we go. made up of the notes C, E, and G. And here we have another C and another E. We even have an E down here, which you can integrate if you'd like that. Um, now, C, E, G, you can play it all over the guitar. C, E, G. I have always like uh, finding C, E, G in different places. C, G. C, E, G. Here you have C, E, and G. But we're gonna take this C chord here Again, the three notes of C, E, G. I'm going to move it around, okay? I'm going to make it, I'm going to turn it into a movable chord. So simply by doing this, moving it up two frets, moving it up all the way up here, I'm going to bring it an octave higher, right up here. So this is a C note. Here's an E, here's a G. So let's do that again. C, E, G, C, and E. Moving it back a whole step. I'm going to do a little uh, finger picking here with all those chords that I just played. So there you have it, C, E, G uh, travels around quite a bit. You can move it and find some new textures and uh, experiment. That's what it's all about. And have some fun and come visit us back here at TheGuitarBazaar.com for your next chord of the day. Thank you. Life is short. Play your ass off. TheGuitarBazaar.com